Independence means that the people of Scotland will be in charge of Scotland's future. Together we care most about our nation, so nobody else is going to make as good a job of making Scotland a success. Scotland has 25% of the EU's offshore wind and tidal energy potential, which could be worth up to £14 billion a year. Scotland more than pays her way in the UK. We contribute 9.9% in UK taxes, but only receive 9.3% back in UK spending. Scotland already pays for all the government services we need as an independent country. We don't have to start from scratch. Scotland doesn't need oil to become independent, but our oil and gas resource is worth well over a trillion pounds and provides a safety net for the future. If you do include oil and gas in our national accounts, we would be the eighth wealthiest nation per capita in the developed world. With independence, we're saving some UK spending. So the initial start-up cost will be met by the £250 million annual saving from the UK's nuclear weapons and the £50 million annual saving from no longer paying for politicians at Westminster. If Scotland votes yes, the first independent parliament will be elected in 2016. Scotland would remain part of the European Union. We can't just be kicked out. And EU law makes clear that Scotland won't be forced to join the Euro. We'll continue to use the pound just as we do today. Scotland has a wealth of talent. For our size, we have more world-class universities than any other nation. And our research tops worldly tables. Mm -hmm.